larger chunk of our engagement towards question and answer session. And of course, we'll have closing remarks. But of course, because of the unique nature of this particular gathering and the importance that it carries to not only the Republic of Zambia, Sweden, and others, but the entire globe, we will take a good photo so that we will remember this day for as long as we will live, but also give an opportunity for the media to interact with the panelists, but also pose questions that they feel are pertinent for this particular engagement. That is the program that we've lined up uh, for you. But of course, as you sit, you are in Sweden. So because we're in Sweden, at this juncture, allow me to call upon the ambassador of Sweden to the Republic of Zambia, Mr. Johan Kalimbori, to come and give his welcome remarks. Your Excellency, please. Alexei Hallam, Professor of Comparative Politics at the National University of Kiev. Ms. Charlotte Rode, Deputy Director of the Stockholm Center for Eastern European Studies at the Swedish Institute for International Affairs. Mr. Muleng Kula, Lecturer in Development Studies at UNSA. Mr. Evans Dalka, Lecturer in Political Science at UNSA. Mr. Martin Hegwar, Lecturer in Public Administration at UNSA and also Regional Manager for the Varieties of Democracy Project. Mr. Boniface Chamber, Executive Director of SACOR. Distinguished experts and students, members of the media, ladies and gentlemen, we are warmly... Ladies and gentlemen. On the morning of 24th February 2022, Russia began its full-scale invasion of Ukraine an independent democratic state. This followed eight years after Russia's illegal annexation of Crimea in Eastern Ukraine in 2014. Russia's full-scale invasion of Ukraine demonstrates boundless contempt for international law, the European security order, and the most fundamental rules of the UN. Just a second. One of the permanent members of the Security Council, tasked to uphold and defend the UN Charter, invades. You see, another I'm watching. Um, As of today, uh, ZNBC. I'm watching this uh, this topic here, eh? and coincidentally, it's not that I I thought about it anyway. You see that. Together we must safeguard the world order based yeah. on respect for the UN Charter. And allow me to be very clear. At the, the impact of Russia's invasion Russia's of Ukraine and effect on Zambia. You see? Sponsored by the Swedish embassy. And that is the Swedish embassy, uh, Swedish ambassador. Now, this is hypocrisy. Hmm. This is hypocrisy, and the hypocrisy that I hate about the, the Western countries. They are, I mean, these guys, they are so hypocritical. You know, they come up with these, these agendas, you know, and they look so noble, and yet they are just hypocrites. Look, these people, they are not saying anything about the invasion of uh, uh, Palestine by by. Uh, by Israel, eh? Hmm. Let me let me switch off this nonsense. Where is that? Where is the? Uh, Russia threatens not only our security, but they 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 are they are ignoring the genocide that is happening in um, in uh, ah useless people. Ah, I'm telling you, this hypocrisy. The hypocrisy of the West, of the Western countries. I mean, the people are dying. They are, uh, uh, Israel is killing, you know, Palestinians like uh, flies. They don't care. They don't care. Volume is not okay. Is that so? Is that so? 
Is that so? Can somebody also confirm that? Is it is it true that uh, my volume is not okay? Is my volume not okay? Piri also Benson Piri is also saying the same thing. Volume. What's up? I can hear you. Thank you, Mose. I think it's very okay. Yeah. Anyway, so you know the challenge that I, that I that I have for me. You know, when you speak about justice, let it let it be justice. When you speak about fairness, let it be fairness. You cannot have, you know, a segregative justice. There is no volume. No, the volume is okay. Okay, thank you very much. I, I, I mean, I don't like this so-called segregative justice. You know, for other people, it's okay. For 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 Israel to invade a, a Palestine, it's okay. But for Russia to invade Ukraine, it's 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 not okay and if you consider the situations it's pretty russia's situation is even much better than what is happening in 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 in, in palestine a lot of you i don't like to talk about it so much because of course that issue is highly embroiled embroidered in um you know uh, some history a very difficult history but you can you can forget about the history you can talk about whatever whatever the bible and whatever just to talk on human rights basis from my point of view just to talk about, on human rights basis it doesn't matter whether they came from jacko or jacob and whatever whatever i don't care just on human rights basis just on human rights basis how can you have people living in a in an open prison because the Palestinians, the Palestinians live in an open prison. It's an open prison. That Gaza that you, you hear of is an, it, it's, it's, it's an open prison. It's an open prison. How can you say, you know, citizens are free when you limit their movements? You limit their movements. You, 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 you put a wall around them and you control uh, them going going in and going out you control what they do you control their food you control their electricity you control what they can access you control where they go eh? in the name of no they are fighting hamas they are fighting hamas where is this hamas where is this hamas because i mean right now gaza for example it's a rubble it's a rabo. It's a rabo. It's a rabo. There is there is nothing there. People have been displaced, eh? and these 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 Western countries they are supporting Israel. Israel is committing atrocities. Israel is committing genocide. Israel Israel is practicing apartheid, and these. You know, so-called America and Western countries are supporting them. And they want to come here and, you know, do this nonsensical propaganda in our country to say, you know, the impact of, uh, you know, invasion of uh, Ukraine by Russia. Uh, what? Nonsense. That's the nonsense. Look at this. Look at these people. Eh? Look, at, look at these people. It's, it's, it's total nonsense, really. It's total nonsense. I'm telling you, this is nonsense. The, uh, the impact. This is total nonsense. Believe me. This one. It's total nonsense. This is just nonsense. This one is nonsense. Not my brother, Chembe. Of course, he was just uh, brought here to be the master of ceremony. So, it is not about Chembe. But it's about these these bazungus who are coming to do propaganda here it's nonsense for you the uh, uh, the swedish uh, embassy to come and do propaganda in zambia when you are tolerating people being killed in palestine it is nonsensical it is hypocritical you should stop it you should stop it as far as i'm concerned that i we for me 
Chirufa Tayari, as president of Economic and Equity Party, we don't support this nonsense because it's hypocritical. You cannot be talking about, you know, the invasion of Ukraine, and yet you are allowing genocide, you are allowing uh, apartheid being committed in, 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 in Palestine. It's total nonsense, total nonsense. Anyway, let's get back to Zambia. Let's get back to Zambia anyway. But uh, some of these some of these issues. Ah, I'm telling you, Mchalwich. Of course, Zambia Zambia uh, uh, took um didn't vote in the last um voting on 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 uh, the Middle East, whatever they didn't vote, I will not comment on that. But I will leave it because uh, UPND is UPND. Uh, Economic and Equity Party is 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 another party. And if you if you like, I mean that those are some of the reasons where you know I remain Economic and Equity Party. Yeah, but these things, eh, these things, they have an impact on Zambia. The war in Ukraine has an impact on Zambia. The, the Middle East war has an impact on Zambia. Some of you who are busy talking about UPND promises and whatever, whatever, you are right. You can talk about yeah, my glasses. My wife, uh, give me some, give me the alcohol of, from the from the office the alcohol from the office i want to clean my glasses sorry Those, those cupcakes you baked, they are finished. Eh? Thank you. <sighs> you don't want to bake some tonight? Okay, but in the cook, 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 in the I'm too broke. And you know when I'm broke, I don't think I don't function properly. It's like what they say in philosophy at you know a, a hungry mind cannot philosophize. I am broke. I am so so broke. And uh, I'm I'm failing to think properly. So they run a topic na ngukulanda na ipatiksha really just that. Uh, yesterday I was advertising that no tomorrow I'll be talking and do so otherwise mm, I I almost didn't want to I almost didn't want to talk I almost didn't want to talk tonight so maybe maybe I'll, I'll just like leave it as an open topic uh, and then I'll just um, allow you to talk and I'll pick up topics as you phone in. So I'll open phone lines uh, almost immediately so that you can uh, call in and, in, you know, um, uh, call, uh, talk about um, anything and I'll, I'll pick it up from there. Ah, I'm, I'm out, but Lelo, I feel like Ngani Nchitonga na Chapa strike. You know, this, and this is the thing, eh? with some of you, you think that, uh, no, Tayadi, you're supporting UPND eh, because of money. No, there is no money. There is no money. And there is no agreement so far between myself and the UPND. There is no agreement between myself and the UPND. But like always, me, I'm a person that operates in, um, in transparency. And in that, in the last date, in that my phone calls. So, 
Hello. Hello. Hi, Mr. Hello. Hello, how are you? I'm I'm fine. I'm fine. Uh they don't they don't no, okay. The they line don't, is uh, go ahead. The line is not very good. Yeah, I just want you said that we can talk about anything. I just want you to talk about what happened. I saw a video where a young a young man was gunned down. Mm. Yeah. Mm. That issue. I would like you to talk about it. What really happened? I don't know exactly, but it's 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 just something that really made me mad, and I I cried. I said, "How can someone just lose his life like that?" Thank you. Thank you. Thank you very much. Okay, I'll talk about that. I'll talk about that. Um, I'll talk about that. Uh, of course, it's a heavy. It's a heavy situ. It's a it's a heavy situation. It's an emotional situation. Um, but let me just say this. You know, I, I we are losing our Ubuntu. We are losing our Ubuntu because of politics. Eh? Everything for us, it's politics, politics, politics. I mean, I, I, I really don't like this. And, you know, for me, these things... You said to the changes. I don't change. I don't change on what I believe in, on what I stand on. I don't change. These things I used to condemn even when UPND was in power. Oh, uh, uh, PF was in power and UPND was in opposition. I used to condemn. I used to condemn uh, when uh, UPND used to, uh, used to, to, to politicize you know, certain sad incidences. I used to complain. I complained to a, an extent of, you know, uh, uh, President HH even took me to, even took me to, to, to police. He went and reported me at uh, Woodlands Police Station when, um, when that girl at Unza was killed because I condemned the way they politicized that that uh, that incident, I condemned it. If you remember, do you remember very well the issue? You know, I feel bad that I mean I even have to go back to the to that issue, but I condemned the way they politicized that issue. I condemned it. I condemned the way the 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 that girl who was killed also uh, at downtown. I condemned it. I condemned the way a number of people when people die. I, from my point of view, we must be we must sympathize and not to make political mileage, and not to make political mileage. And I will be I, I will I will speak without fear without fear or favor that UPND and PF, you are like uh, 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 what is this at the semen twins? Eh? Is it semen twins? You are you are identical twins. You, you are the same. UPND used to do these things. Today, the PF where you are doing exactly the same thing. And when we try to talk, you are saying, no, UPND used to do this. So by the fact that UPND used to do wrong things, then even you, it is justified to do wrong things. I mean, we have lost a life. And instead of sympathizing with the family, you are busy trying to make political mileage. We are busy trying to make political mileage. Me, that's what I'm against. I'm against you making politic, political capital out of the demise of any Zambian. It doesn't matter which political party, wherever. That is what I'm against. And it is not today that I've been against. I am saying it. If you go back and check in your archives, you will remember. You will remember that I spoke about it. I criticized the uh, UPND to an extent that even President Hakainde Ichilem at that time was upset with me and even went and reported me to police that I was implicating him. Because look, some of these things, I mean, it's like na mutemwa. Mula temwa, when certain things happen, mula temwa, it's like you are happy. Eh? It's like you are happy. It's like Mwakwatila, you have a platform now. 
you have something to talk about. You are political failures. I'm telling you. You are political failures. All of you who are politicizing the death of that young boy, you are political failures. You have, you have got very bad hearts. I'm going to say the same thing that I said during that time. You are happy. Don't pretend that you are not happy. You are happy. You are just pretending that you care. You don't bloody care. You are happy that the, the death of a child has given you some political, you know, platform for you to talk. Come on. I mean, let's be real. Let's be real. I mean, yes, it is very unfortunate. And I sympathize with the family very much. I sympathize with the family. I sympathize with the family. A death of a child, that child is as good as my child. It is really, really sad. But to start bringing in like government intended it, like government intended it, this is what I'm against. This is what I'm against. This is an unfortunate incident. Can we condemn it as it is? Instead of now making it like the entire government orchestrated this to eliminate a child. That is what I'm against. Why do you want to blow things out of proportion? Bring it where it, where it is not. To an extent of you trying to bring in Haka in the Ichirema. Honestly, how do you bring Haka in the Ichirema? In the death of this young person. How? Given, given, I insist, it is bad, it is sad. And I offer my sincere condolences to the family. But to drag in the entire government, we? that is not right. That is not right. That is not right. That is wrong. To make it like government planned it or government intended. Like this, it is the purpose of this government. It is the objective of this government to be killing Zambians. No. I condemned it during the, when the Haka in the was doing that, I condemned it. Even now, even now, even now, I want to say it. Even now, when they are in power by UPND, they are fond of mentioning some of these people that have died out of political violence. But they only mention the UPND. Why do you only mention the UPND? Why don't you also talk about uh, uh, the other people that have died in, uh, in other political parties? Especially that now that you are in power, because some of these people, you have even gone to an extent of, of compensating them. But what about those who died, who were from the other party? There are Zambians as well. That is one Zambia, one nation. And that is what we talk about when we say, you know, looking after the state. You look after everybody. You look after everybody. So I condemn the UPND the same way that I'm condemning you by, UP, by, by PF with the way you are trying to politicize the death of this, this young, 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 young person. Of course, we condemn the incidents, how it happened. I mean, of course, the police are investigating it. Uh, I would not devour. I would not go into the details to say this is what happened, this is what happened. I will leave that to the investigations, to the investigative uh, uh, agencies to, to get into it and make sure that, uh, you know, the people that were involved are brought to book and for the family that lost this child to be compensated, to be compensated. That's what we should be talking about. That's what we should be talking about for the the, 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 the police must go in, investigate this matter uh, and make sure that uh, necessary steps are taken, but also the family to be looked after. I, I hope that government already they, must, they are helping. I hope that they are helping the family right now. As I'm talking for me, I, am not, I don't want to start pointing fingers on government. All I can do is to appeal to government that as we are talking right now, can you make sure that the family is, uh, is uh, the, the burden of losing this child is eased? That is, that is what I can do. That is, what I, that is what I'm doing. I am appealing to government. I am not going to point fingers at government. No, they are, you are not the ones that you didn't send the, uh, the officer or whoever uh, fired the bullet. You didn't send that person to shoot. 
I mean, which government does that honestly? Eh? Even if you 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 want to uh, to incite people against the government, even if you want to incite people against the government, surely there is a limit to what you can do. You cannot accuse the government to say they are killing people eh, in cold blood. No, come on, let's be real. Eh? Why would that kind of HLM do that? Why would government do that? Why? Eh? Why? But what we can do now is to ask government that there is a funeral. Wherever the funeral is, please go there. Make sure that you ease the burden of the people that are mourning. You ease the burden. And further on, make sure that you console the family through, through you know, uh, some token of compensation. That is what we are supposed to be talking about. That is sympathizing with the family. Not now, busy spreading the body of this young person on social media. What are you doing? Who is benefiting out of that? When you are busy spreading this, you know, you are just trying to incense the public. That's all you are doing. That's all you are doing. You, are, you want to incense the public? You want to incense the public? You want the public to turn against the government, to hate the government? No, it's wrong. It's wrong. You are not looking after you, uh, uh, the family. You are not looking at the family. You are looking at your political interest, your selfish interest. Because what you are supposed to be talking about is to see, to make sure that uh, government helps with the funeral issues. Government comes in to, you know, uh, ameliorate the loss. You cannot compensate life. You cannot bring back life. No, no compensation is enough for life. A life is more precious. Life has no value. But, you know, under the circumstances, you, you do something. That is what you should be talking about. Not the nonsense that you are doing, spreading that, uh, that, 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 that picture of that young man, uh, of that young, young man uh, on social media. It is very wrong. Me, I'm against it. My position is, government, please help on the funeral. Number two, make sure that that family is compensated. That is my uh, my submission on that one. I can't go into details to say this is what happened and whatever, whatever, because those are issues that um, the investigative wings have to look into. Hello? 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 <laughs> Hello? 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 Yes, yes, Hello? yes. Please go ahead. Hello? Yes, please go ahead. Okay. The land of whoever to go to the very official will win over Tayari. I am a politics, I would dangisha, never be a bad and share a maridas, but you know, ma. The Wastika scan, the Bambo Pela problem, government, what government here to think of the government when a Miomun to Fabal and the band to get a few in a day at your work at the Gabion which they fung. Imagine. I am a politics here, Shung, Muzam, Yashu, I didn't get a poor. Pamun and Dua go up to the Munina. Hello. 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 Yes, yes. Hello. Hello. Yes, yes. Hello. Hello. We can hear you. Hello. You are the president. Yes, sir. Bwanji Bolul. Bwina Bwina Bwanji. Yes. First, I'm feeling sorry for you. Your complaint, you could see my problem, you could see you know? That's one, that is very bad. That means our economy is still going to be. And then that you are going to be, you are going to be, you are So I feel sorry for that. What of the rest, but that's what you can say, but it's true. It's true, it's true, it's true, it's true, it's true. Secondly, 
Yes, seven day in Kanyamane in that chick up. Yes, uh, in a Mkona Kwanga. Abantu uh, kati president daka amba kuti uh, don't take your law into your own hands. Abantu uh, they break the law. Bantu wali government yaki. Hensi bantu mwendo ukaripa. Kibweza ukari kuli kuli hiye. Because abantu kati waziba. Should be, there should be some measures. But I want to, but but you should do them. But your papa, but it's time that you're going to lose your benefits once you cause a, a problem, which you will know that you're not supposed to do that. But you know, what I'm saying is not going to be. Wait a minute. These are the problems we're talking about. Not to drag them up. Hello. Yeah, but but yes. wait a wait a minute. Uh, surely, I think let's leave that the issue of the of the of the young man aside. Okay. Let's leave that one aside. Because we don't know the circumstances, okay. uh, how that okay. boy died. So I think let's leave that one aside. Um, please let's leave okay. that one aside. Mm. Okay, this is your mind. Okay, think about my third point. Whenever you take a mono, when we are changing them, the, the government mm. we change for the better. We don't change for the worse. Well. Mm. Now the problem is that we are not going to power. We are going to be bossed by the and now. You would find Muntu, Voipa, you want to refer. You want to refer to the good things or refer to the bad things. Mm. You should not live like that. Mm. You, you must live by, by example. I'll do different. Exactly. Now the problem, yes, now mm. the problem, you would find. Uyo mtu mama vote la foot. Na vote amaning kuti a part bikabona change. Now you would find this the same things. Vene tena kuenga na PF vaka pokola vala vivi kwa vala na kumene sufu na kuoneka. These things are coming back again. Na who do we blame? Who do we blame? We are going to blame wa mene who is in charge kuamba kuti aba uza aba kuti hivi vitu nini vina nakana and i went through these things why are you doing that you know now if you keep quiet we are assuming kuti ndio wameva watuma oh na tare you do you hear me what i'm saying yes yes i can hear you yes because you ngati mwana ko au nonga vitu pa nyumba you are not saying anything on hatambe zi ni sio uzi bataje kumwa mtuma kuta mwana because these people are they must learn something but if we are not calm but whether you just get in or what we go go vote it actually but we are not going to vote but when you come you 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 are a victim but because them they in power they never felt and they say una pay but they say open up still but they are not open so for me i'm very sad what is happening with this government because they attacked you. If it not going to be you will not come back to you. We will come back to my name. We come back to the Bueno. Because if you come back, you think you are under the carpet. That's a democracy opinion on Kali. So I will leave it there. I won't go further than that. Thank you. Hello. 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 Yes, please. Hello. Hello. Yes, we can hear you. Yeah, good evening, Atani. Good evening. Yeah, Patrick from Ondora. Okay, Patrick, please go ahead. Eh, 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 Ebare ipa ya nangu ni magapoko ebare shuta filia. Adai kia baba ba hizi hizi baisha mengine ni mapenzi ina shia ni ni magapoko ebare shuti. Now we want to show the way hizi hizi to say as if we are saying. Ah, mona mona. Ah, listen, 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 listen. I have already said. I have already said when. When President Ed Galungu was there, I used to condemn those who were putting, you know, these uh, uh, unfortunate situations on Lungu. I used to condemn it. I used to condemn it. So even now, 
even now uh -huh, so, i am not changing so i mean <laughs> i think that, that uh, we we know the answers already you can't ask the questions when we have already spoken about it so i mean <laughs> why are you asking we have already yes, so, we have already spoken uh, about uh, that let me just finish now i, I know it's, it's talk about something now. else i'm not interested uh, in, in these things we have I, i'm not no. interested in this i want to talk about something else I'm not interested in this because yes, I'm, yes, I'm already guided. You are saying to say, mm. uh, but uh, yes, you have already, you have already uh, said about it. So I've already guided on that one. I mean, what is wrong is wrong. So come on, what is there to talk about? As far as I'm concerned, take those debates elsewhere, not on my platform. As far as I'm concerned, on my platform, I condemn the politicizing of unfortunate incidences i condemn that i condemn that whether it is upnd whether it is pf i condemn the politicizing of uh, uh sad incidences i condemn it i condemned it during the time of pf i am condemning it even now let us you know uh look at situations as they are and sympathize with a family and urge the government to compensate the people and not to start politicizing because you are politicizing i don't want to politicize these instances nakana don't politicize them because if you start saying hey but lungu uh, but when valungu was there vale but valungu ever lay pair no mbashan chani ah ah that is politicizing that is politicizing. You know, we know it's not Balungu was sending those people. And we know it is not HH who is sending these people. So why are we politicizing it? Please let us not politicize it. Let's talk about other issues. Napa Pat. Hello? Good evening, uh, President Daly. How are you? Fine, fine. Thank you. Okay. Uh, um, my, I think my focus would be on uh, UPND and its governance. Uh -huh. Look, I'll be honest with you. I'm, I'm one person that doesn't like uh, Oman Lusa because of his uh, behavior mm -hmm. when they were in power. Mm -hmm. But the truth is, the way UPND is using police to intimidate politicians is pathetic, mm -hmm. for lack of a better term. Mm -hmm. HH was supposed to be our president for all Zambians. We rallied behind HH despite the things that they told us, despite the many warnings that they got. We voted for him, put him into power, thinking that he will be our messiah, if we can say that. HH was supposed to be somebody that was going to turn around our economy. And as it is, we know there are many factors. Mm -hmm. that are affecting the economy and are causing it to, to be where it is now. Mm -hmm. But one thing that UPND has in control mm -hmm. right now, at the moment, mm -hmm. is to give Zambia the democracy that PF did not give it. Mm -hmm. Now, it is disheartening to see that the very HH that went through the torture of PF mm -hmm. is bringing those things back. And in its early term, and what HH should realize and UPND is that they are not popular. Mm. They did not win the elections because HH is popular. No, they won elections because Zambians wanted to teach PF a lesson. Mm. It wanted to teach politicians a lesson. Mm. And now the way UPND is treating other politicians, Zambians were very sensitive people. Listen to what I just told you. I said, I did not like Boman Musambu. Yes, yes. But looking at what happened to him, mm. I sympathize with a man. Mm. Why? I'm a parent. Mm. I'm a man. When I look, look, you look at you where you are. Mr. Taylor may not agree mm. to this, mm. but the truth is that you are afraid to speak your mind no, right no, no. now at the moment. No, no, no. Deep down Listen, your heart. Wait a minute. Wait a minute. It's not that... Um, uh, I have hidden this. No, I've said it. Me, I say it. My friend, yesterday I was in court. Today I, I, I was in court. Tomorrow I'll be in court. On Friday I'll be in court. Do you think I want to, to be careless in my talking? No, 
No, I don't want. I don't you, want you more, 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 no, more this police. Is, this is a... This is exactly what we are talking about. They warned us, they told us that HH is vindictive. And it is disappointing that he's living up to that fact today. It is so disappointing. Personally, I am so disappointed. I'm very, very much disappointed. I spent my own money, my own resources. I did not even, nobody even knows me in your PND just so that we can put this government in power, so that we can build a democracy. Some of us live in the diaspora. Mm. We only have one place and one Zambia. And looking at them destroying the, our nation, killing our democracy, especially now, especially these same people that, were, that went through the hands of PF were tortured, it is so disheartening and so disappointing. No, thank you, thank my brother. you so much. Thank you. Thank you. Now, um, allow me before I take another caller and allow me to um, make a comment on, on this issue. Um, you see, they say it takes two to tango. This is where I'm going to start. It takes two to tango. Yes, we have a democracy. That's for sure. We have a democracy. And uh, we are free to express ourselves, we are free to associate, we are free to move about, we are free to pray, uh, you know, we, we, with whatever uh, religion or whatever. So we have got these freedoms, that is for sure. And uh, for political parties, they have got the right to offer checks and balances, to offer checks and balances. Unfortunately, what is happening at the moment, what is happening at the moment, and please follow me very carefully, what is happening at the moment, there is some kind of a political strategy. There is a political strategy. And this political strategy is where, like, where we are trying to politicize everything. Trying to politicize everything. Please follow me very well and follow me with logic, eh? with reasoning. There is a political strategy. There is some kind of a political strategy. This political strategy, which, I mean, even myself, I, I participated in it. And if anything, I could even say that I started it. I could start, I started it, if, if, if you like. And what is that political strategy? The political strategy which is there is to label this government that this government has failed. Okay? And I, I for one, I for one, I am one of those people. If anything, I might say I am the first one that, that brought out these political strategies. To label this government that this government has failed. Remember, I used to say, Haka inde ichirema na firwa. At one point, I even came up to say, Haka inde ichirema must resign. Haka inde ichirema must be impeached. You remember those, uh, those of you who have been following me. Those are political strategies. And uh, so, and, 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 and so, this government has failed. Frankly speaking, at that point, I was even pushing for an early election. I was even pushing for an early election. I was even pushing for an early election. But these are political strategies. These are political strategies. It is there in politics. And there is no crime in doing that. There is no crime in doing that. And because of those political strategies, I, 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 I invited trouble on myself. And of course, when you are coming up with these political strategies, where you want to label a government that the government has failed, you must bring an alternative. <laughs> you must... I'm even laughing with myself. Because really, some of you, I mean, as much as um, <laughs> you, might, you might think that I'm a pushover, I'm not a pushover. I sit and I, you know, I think and I come up with these things. So I started these things. Remember, it's me. Who said Haka in the Ichri must fail? Haka in the Ichri must resign. Haka in the Ichri must be impeached. I was talking about these things. And of course, when you are talking about this, that the government has failed, the guy who is there has failed, you must show people an alternative. And I quickly, 
went to Edgar Lungu. I saw Edgar Lungu was already sold. I went to Edgar Lungu, asked him, can you come back? At first he refused, but later on, when he refused, I picked Mundubila. When I picked Mundubila, later on, by Edgar Lungu saw that, he, this thing is gaining momentum. He showed interest. And I brought back the Alebo de Rapport agenda. So, partly, I want to raise my hands to say, I am guilty that I started some of these political uh, issues. Some of these things that people are talking about are things that I actually brought out and uh, implanted them in the minds of the people. Like the issue of the, the shrinking of democracy. It's me who said this government is a dictator. It was a political strategy and I came out strongly. I came out strongly. And trust me, as much as some of you might think that uh, I'm a pushover, a lot of you swallowed those pills that I was giving you. They are like pills. Every day you give. Every day you give. Every day you give. Eventually people start responding. So some of you, I want to tell you that some of you took my prescription, took my dosages of, you know, labeling this government as a failure, labeling Yaka in the as a failure, and of course, labeling this government as a dictator. And of course, unfortunately, this government, this is a mistake that they made. The mistake that they made, when I'm saying that, you know, uh, this government is a dictator. They made a mistake to fall into my trap by coming to me, arresting me so many times. Trust me, when they were arresting me so many times, they were falling into my trap. They were falling into my trap. Because they were confirming what I was talking about. When I come here, I say, this government is a dictator. This government is a dictator. And for them, the more I say he's a dictator, the more they come here. The more they even intensify on their activities. They even start sending now people masked up with guns. I go and complain, they lock me up. They were confirming what I was saying. They were confirming what I was saying. And a number of you now believed what I was saying. To say, yeah. It's true what he, talk, what he talks about. These guys are dictators. Look what they are doing to his house. And they were really fall, falling into my, into my trap because, look, I've got cameras all over eh, around this house. I've got cameras all over. And when they were coming, I was catching, eh, catching them on cameras and putting them on social media. They were falling into my trap. Trust me, it ain't going to be a good thing. If I had money, that's, I mean, I'm just being honest. But now, what about now? There is a change of, 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 of mind. There are times when you look at to say, look, as much as I'm doing this, I'm engaging these political strategies. But are they productive? Are they good for the country? So I reached the, a realization where I had so many cases, Uku, even now I've got so many cases. But then when I look at it on the other side, I said, okay, even if I'm doing these things, I even don't have people to help me. You know, I don't have the resources, people to help me. You need, you need a good legal team that you are paying well. Not Abama lawyers, Wakupa Patira, Mulikwisa, please come and stand for me, whatever, whatever. It, it, it can't work. It can't work. But then you also look at the other aspect. If we change government, if we push this government out, let's imagine tomorrow we have an election. Let's just imagine tomorrow we have an election. Tomorrow we have an election. And Haka in the Ichirema goes. Are you telling me we are going to make some, some gains? Are we going to move? Trust me, as we are right now, if we remove Haka in the Ichirema today, we remove Haka in the Ichirema today. We would not be going forward. We would actually go in back. Haka in the Ichirema so far has made some positive strides. And I'm not saying this at Indeti. Uh -uh. I'm telling you the truth. I'm telling you like a repentant sinner. Like a repentant criminal. Here I'm telling you like a repentant political uh, strategist, political propaganda, propagandist. Mungu Fugisha, I'm talking to you as a repentant political strategist, 
political a political uh, repentant uh, propagandist. Those things that I was talking about, I was making sure I wanted to paint this government bad. I wanted to paint this government bad. And of course, I was hoping that, you know, when we kick them out, I knew I wouldn't be president immediately. That's why I was pushing the the Avena Munduvide, I was pushing a Avena Edgarungu because I knew I wouldn't. I know I've got, I need some more years. I need to be part of government. I need to make money somehow. I need to make connections before I step up on that platform for me to say, now I want to be president. But for now, since I can't be president, I have to push others. That's why some of you young people who don't understand you, you are, but how come you're always talking about others? You're always talking about others. It is a political strategy. I don't have what it takes. I don't have everything. It is like an, a, 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 a soldier who is going into a war. You must make sure that you have all the ammunition. You have all your people around you. And then you go in. What is the point of going in when you don't have ammunition, you don't have whatever, whatever? You know, you don't. So you hire yourself to work with others. This is why you see me trying to work with others. And some of these people that I want to work with, it's me who actually propel them. Valungu, Valungu's time is gone. It is me who was trying to bring him back. And some of you who were thinking that, you know, you can push the agenda. You can never push the agenda of Walewe Rapo. You can never bring Valungu into presidency. You can't. With me on the other side, Ndemieva. You can't bring Valungu into power with me opposing it. You can't, Ndemio. I pushed that agenda and you believed it because I pushed it that Alewe Rapo. And you looked at it to say, ah, it's possible Kutia Wele Rapo. The moment I put back, Alewe Rapo is gone. And it is gone. It is gone. It will not come back. Valungu can never come back as president unless a miracle happens. So I am speaking to you as a repentant that look, I have changed. And what has made me change? What has made me change? I'm being honest with you. The issues of resources. I mean, going to police and whatever, whatever, whatever. I mean, it was just too much. And then secondly, really, even if I had the money and I succeed in this, can I move the country? Will the country move forward? Imagine to Awesha Walungu. Will the country move forward? The country will never move forward. It will never move forward. And you know, it is one thing when you know somebody from afar. When you know people close by, then you realize, you measure them. You measure them. Some of you, you see people from afar and you think that there is something. But really, when you bring them close, then you realize to say, ah, tapali filipo. Tapali filipo. Chimo na kwa tifida wa gero. You know? Eh? Wa gero. Wama wa gero ngwa mwono lesha. Le mwono ikamu ino. You think that if uyu uyu. But at the end of the day, mdara, wasanga tapali filipo. So, even in politics, it's like that. Sometimes you get excited. You see some of these people. You think that, ah, uyu, uyu, uyu. But when you bring them close, when you know them, you come to realize to say, ah, tapari filipo. When I started the Alewe Rapu, when I was looking at Valungu, I thought he can do it. But after being close with him, being close with him, engaging with him, I realize he can't, he can't do it. I realize he can't manage to be president. He can't. I realized Valungu cannot do as anything. He can't. He can't. He can't. He can't take us forward. So even if we succeeded, he wouldn't take us anywhere. So this is what made me change my mind. This is what made me change my mind. Now, getting back to this caller, that this government is showing, is following the same path. Some people have picked up my agenda. The PF and some of these guys, they have picked up my agenda. They, are, they have continued on that same trajectory. On that strategy which I introduced, they have continued. They have picked up some of my strategies. And they are running with them. They are running with them. They are running with them saying this government has failed. They are running with it. They are running with it that this government is a dictator. They are running with it. And unfortunately, this government is making the same mistake that they were making on me. The same mistake of arresting me, they arrested me nine times, nine times. 
They are making the same mistake now following some of these people who are politically dead. Some of these people, they are politically dead. And you are making a mistake by following them. You think you are, you are, you are trying to intimidate them, but in the eyes of the public, you are messing yourself up. You are messing yourself up. They have picked up the agenda of making this government look like it is a failure. Making Haka Inde Ishirigma look like he's a failure. They are making this government look like it's a dictator. They are creating that narrative. And in women and put your government, you are making the same mistake that you are making on me. Arresting them day, every day, every day, every day. They are gaining. They are gaining. Some of these people, they are not worth the, the investment that you are putting in. There is so much investment. There is so much investment. They are not worth it. They are not worth it to grace the news, the public media. But these people, they are covered. A politician, a politician worth his sort is, must be discussed in the news every day. Every day. And some of these people, by the fact that you are arresting them, Boman de Loma Mwikata, Mairo Mwikata, Mairo Mwikata, Mairo Alikukoti, Boman, you are keeping Boman alive. You are keeping Boman alive. And before you know it, like the caller said, people will start sympathizing with Boman. Before they didn't like Boman, because Ale Lopola Van Difficulty, because he was arrogant, because he was what, 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 what. But now Bowman cannot do those things because he doesn't have the power. So, but what are you doing? You are busy talking about Bowman. Busy talking about Bowman. Eh, nawa muikatalelo, nawa muikatalelo, nawa muikatalelo. People start sympathizing with him. They will forget about the bad things that he did. And they will start looking at the bad things that you are doing to him. Same, same, nawa lungu chimo chini. Valungu, people who eventually forget the bad things that Valungu did. How bad, you know, he failed the economy. They will forget. They will be, be sympathizing. So, this is for my brothers and sisters in UPND. That be very careful. You might think that you are winning this, but you are actually falling into the ditch. Especially these instances whereby, sole no boma nala ala masios. My no boma nyakafuma. Because in that time, you will also be looking back to say, ah, how many days, Bowman? Hey, three days. Hey, four days. Yeah, Bowman. Then in the time, he will be, yeah, I'm a champion. I'm a champion. You are losing out. You are losing out. And these are the issues that you PND need to look at. You are wasting time with these people. Instead of looking at how can you Convince people that President Haka Inde Ichirema has moved this country forward. How can you convince people that President Haka Inde Ichirema is the right president at the moment? How can you convince the people out there that in spite of the challenges, this is the government that they should have confidence in? This is what should preoccupy your mind. This is what you should be investing in. But you are investing in Muriwa Kapokola. Invest in the PR show that Haka Inde Ichirima is a Republican president who is working night and day, who is not going to Italy to go and enjoy, who is not going to Germany just to go for, for a $500 uh, uh, allowance, but is going there to work. This is what should preoccupy your mind. But you are not focusing on that by UPND, you are not. You are focusing on it. Who is saying what? Who is saying what? You arrest them. And then you are also, you are very reactive. You are very reactive. The Ministry of Information by UPND. You know, this guy has just provoked me to talk. I wanted, I didn't, I wanted to avoid this. The Ministry of Information is not a reactive ministry. It is not a ministry to counter propaganda. That is not the ministry. That is not the job of that ministry. That is not the job of that ministry. And I hope my friends can, can hear this. The Ministry of Information and Media 
it is not a ministry to counter pro, uh, propaganda. No. It is not a ministry, you know, to, 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 to cover up a, a imingalato. No. That is not the job of that ministry. That ministry is supposed to inform people. To inform. The PR of the president, the PR of the government is in the hands of that ministry. That is, that is the job of that ministry. It is not to be responding to Bowman. It is not to be responding to Chirufatayali. It is not to be, to, to be reporting that, no, this person has been arrested. because That is not the job of that ministry. It is, it is reducing the ministry in Demieva. It is reducing the ministry to reduce it to be churches, churches. That is not the job of that ministry. That ministry, Mdala, is to do PR. PR, serious PR, Mdala. Serious PR. Telling the people what the government is doing. Engaging with people. That ministry should be, you know, should be the, the personification of the government. The minister of information must be somebody that is all over. Hey, I'm, I don't want to come out to talk like I'm criticizing anyone. I don't want to do that. Eh? I don't want to do that. I'm just, I'm just telling you. I mean, my brother Cornelius is there. He's a good friend of mine. I don't want to talk like, you know, I'm, 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 uh, I'm criticizing him. No, you know, I mean, after all, he's just new in that ministry. Uh, but, but really, at the moment you have turned that ministry, to be always reacting. Oh no, hey, the church has said this. Oh, this person has said this. You are always reacting. You are always reacting. When you are supposed to be setting up the agenda. When you are supposed to be setting up the agenda. That ministry is supposed to be loaded with so many things that government is doing. The propaganda that we are talking about, it should be coming from that ministry. You are the one who is supposed to be starting with the propaganda. Oh, as government, we need to do this. But before we do this, we need to tell people, oh, how do we make people aware? You leash it out. By the time you are coming out, people are voting. So, I brought this in Demi Eva Mutimu. You can argue. I am a politics. I'm the one that brought these strategies. They are just working in what I started. And I didn't mind Vakapokola coming to arrest me because I was making a name. I knew what I was doing. The problem is I was failed by those who are supposed to, to support me. They failed me. But then, on the other hand, maybe it was by God's grace that they didn't support me because really, even if we succeeded, I don't think we would have helped Zambians. I believe that the trajectory that I've taken is a better trajectory at the moment. It's a better trajectory than the trajectory that I was pursuing uh, last time. I hope uh, you have followed me and you have uh, gotten uh, something. Let me get back to the to the phone lines. You can you can call. Um, the number that you are calling is zero seven six three three zero two two zero seven zero seven six three three zero two two zero seven. 0763302207 that is the, the number you are calling on whatsapp only please just call me on on whatsapp hello hello good good evening mr tari good evening Hello? Yes, we can hear you. Hello? Yes, we can hear you. Yes, yes please. Yes, my president, uh, I disagree with you. By UPND, they have failed. A hundred percent. Hello? Can you, get, can you hear me? I, 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 can, I can hear you, but, uh, you, you know, already right so, there. <laughs> Go ahead. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Go ahead. Yeah, like... 
Yeah, so uh, I think we'll do a swap. You will come to the UPND, I'll go to the PF, and then I also work for the, the PF and the opposition to counteract what will be coming from you. And, and then, I, will, I then, have also reasons why uh, I think the UPND have failed. Listen. I have many, many reasons. Listen, I'm telling you, just that the UPND, they are reluctant to work with me for whatever reason. But trust me, yeah. There is a lot that mm -hmm. they can do to change, including yourself, your mind. I can assure you, I can assure you, I would just give you not even one month. I would give you just two weeks. Two weeks, you will be my disciple. Just that. Now, I'm big. I'm not wanting to change it. Now, I'm changing change it. Vampela. Now, what is required? What is required? Fiance, fiance, and I way. You are just speaking. It's mm -hmm. relative, Mwana. In a, I, I'm okay. telling you, by UPND, they have got all the answers to the challenges that you are talking about. They have them. They have all the answers. Yeah. They have so the Mr. answers. Mr. Mr. Yeah. These guys okay. are doing. They are okay. Just that. Just that they are not able to convince you people. I'm a politics coach to convince our one too. But they are not doing yeah, that. Yeah, so now... Hey, go ahead. The problem... So how have they failed? The problem... Landa Tumfe, how have they failed? Yes. The one, one of the uh, one failure is Uruto Shiruavuari. Economically, I, 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 I'm telling you they have failed lamentably. Like, for example, I know you have argued that it's a global a global uh, problem there. Yes, I agree. It's a global thing. Even here in the UK, we are facing those challenges. Mm. But I'm a guy. Governments, they are there to cushion the sufferings of the people. Like here in the UK, the government, they give subsidies up to this time. I'm a, I'm a, I'm a, some of the things that we were enjoying as a result of COVID-19, we are still enjoying them. So Wait a minute. Them, yeah, are you PND? Okay. Wait a minute. Uh, so according to you, Ukoku Kubulaya, Ekomuikala, there are things that yeah. government is doing, isn't it? Yes. Okay, now, the question which I'm asking you, what about this government? Are you sure they are not doing anything to cushion the, the suffering of the people? Are you sure? Yes, and let me give the so, two reasons or uh -huh, three. Uh -huh. one, one, of them is, one of them is removing subsidies. There's, everywhere you go in the world, even here, subsidies are there. Subsidies, bafumiako kuri fuel, bafumiako na kuma commodities, efi alengo kwa wati, the cost of living, living yawa high. Everywhere you go, ama subsidies eko yawa. The other problem we wa kwete wa UPND ni procurement. Ekuri problem wa kwena, a procurement of farming inputs and fuel. So if you into filele nga, if you ya pampa, if you into pamura, and then the other one, ni tax break kuma minds. I am a tax breaker. I let the income in the country. So as a result, people have pressure. Patu ndalama bare poka kuma through taxes, kuma civil servants and a few things. So it because of pressure. But so those are some of the problem. Uh, I mean, I'm a mistake. Siva panga kopali pakupakupakupoesha the standard of living. Wait. Subsidies wait. 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 You are saying these are okay. the problems that they have done, isn't it? Yes. yes. Uh huh. Now my question still stands: Are you sure this government is not doing anything to cushion the 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 the, the, the sufferings of the people? Are you sure they are not doing anything? That is my question. Hundred, hundred percent, Mister Tari. Uh, okay, let me uh, just uh, say uh, that uh, I have uh, done the little wait, 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 wait. I have done it. Wait, okay. Munina. Is, okay. is, is your answer saying, are you telling me that this government is not doing anything to help the poor? Yeah, I don't, I don't think what they are doing is making any impact. Okay, so you are not sure what they are doing, isn't it? No, 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 I'm sure. I'm, I'm, I'm saying that it's not it, making impact. If, they are, if okay. really they are doing anything, okay. then it's no, not no. making the any impact. Is, the question is, you are saying, do you know? My question is, do you know what they are doing? That is my question. Do you know? Uh, okay. 
Okay, the, you know, in economics, there are indicators that you put in place. So do my you indicators know, the, question the, indicators is, that you... the question is, do you know what policies this government has implemented to help this to, to cushion? Okay, let, let, let me know? answer that question. Yeah, do so, you know? Let, let me, let me, uh, if, 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 if do it was you know? making do some... Do you say... know? Do you know? Tell me if you know okay, or me... you don't know. Okay, let me say that I don't know because I can't Thank see you. anything happening. It's not happening. So, hey, so hey. they are not doing anything. The point is that I want to tell you that I'm going back to say this government has got all the answers mm -hmm. to a lot of issues. The problem ah. is the problem mm -hmm. is they are not informing people. Just like yourself, you are saying uh, you, whatever they are doing, you don't know what they are doing. And you are saying whatever they are doing, mm. it is not giving, showing an impact. It is not showing an impact. Yeah. But from my point of view, yeah. I can tell you that it is just the knowledge that you don't have. If you knew, no, 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 maybe, no. maybe you mm -hmm. would appreciate. If you knew, maybe you would okay, appreciate. Mr. For example, Mr. Tayari, let me give you an example. Okay. Let me give you an example. Okay. Do you know about yeah. social cash transfer? Yeah, I know, I know. You know, before I came to the United Kingdom, I was working in the Ministry of Community Development and Social Services. Yes. I know so, all those programs. So, so tell me, tell me, what is the impact of social cash transfer on what is happening? Uh, it's a disaster, Bakalamba. You know, when you do an assessment of Abako Tiabe and Gabba de Muzambia, the people are getting that money. In fact, the hundred kwachas that they give them, is not even, Ubunga would 300. Do you know how much they get? Uh, hey, how, they how, social, how, how much are they getting? Even if they, for example, ah, let me just much, give them five. How much are they getting? I, I think they are getting ma, ma less than 300 kwacha. So we don't know, isn't it? I think they are getting not more we, than that. The time, we, we, the we time, don't know. the time we don't know. We don't know. We don't know. The point is, but my brother, it, anyway, look, I'm not disagreeing with you that there are challenges. Yes. I'm not disagreeing with you. Yes. I am not disagreeing yes. with everything that you have said. I agree with you. The yes. issue is, yes. the issue is, the, there is also the other aspect. There is something that is being done. Okay. And that which is being done is yeah. not being discussed. And this is why I'm saying governments need to do more. So that what is amplified is not just the negative. Those negatives that you have spoken about, yeah. which I agree. But yeah. those are the only things which mm -hmm. are, we are discussing. We are not discussing the little positive, whether it is little, but there is no one talking about it. That's why you're saying 100%. Because if you know yeah. the little that government is doing, you will not say 100%. Are you going to say 100%? No, if I can see them, I can't say 100%. Yes, but you might even say 90%. I can't say anything. You might even say 90%. Yeah. And that challenge is the challenge that we are putting on government to say, government, can they be able to bring out some of these initiatives that they are doing so that people can see to say, okay, yes, there is failure here, but you are also doing this. And devoid of that, they are seen like total failures, 100% like you put it. Thank you very much, my brother. Let me take yeah. other calls. Just one, just one, just one thing. You know, in economics, there are short terms and long terms, but we can't see anything. Short term and long term, there is nothing. I agree. I agree with you. I agree with you. Hello? Yes, Mr. Tayali. Yes, yes. What is your winner, Kanavesa? Winner, winner from Kwai. And therefore, I'm step of concur if you were from Poland, the previous scholar. Yes, yes. Uh, what he's saying is true. This is a failed project, Tayali. You should just accept. <laughs> You should just accept this is a failed project by my UPNT. Now I feel what. No matter whatever you're going to try to explain, people are enlightened. Now to mona, to lay mona. Chava kwati filia. Chava kwati filia. Ulevo muntu. Atiwe, we kopawa na kashi. Vali shupa. Tabo mfua. Vali stefi. Pati. Na chifika secha kwati. Mfuile na upa. No matter whatever people tells you. Mm. If you look at it, just to help him, 
or if I tell governments, I'm a government, like for example, if I want that yo, Ukraine, whatever, ku mm. England, ku mm. England, ku mm. England, and a few well, how the government helps. Ku mm. are in the crew of Petroda, Petroda, can you introduce maybe Mulia Smiago Naimaka? No, no, as the government writes a subsidize. Mm. Okay, the chance of your finish. Chance of your finish. Tell me about the finish. Hello, in beyond the phone, they connect your dots. Mm. If you look at this guy from Kasama, at least you guys who you UPND, I don't understand. Thomas, Kevin. if you look at if you look at Tom, Thomas number, we are not paying. We are not paying the number, but don't talk about Thomas name. He is taking money from us. Who is Thomas? Thomas name, na you Thomas from Kasama, UPND. Taka tia pa, I don't understand. How we Mulechita, Mulechita obviously promote the Lungu, the Mulewe Kata, whatever. Ana silanga sana ba UPND but ni UPND. Mm. Mwana mwana. Mm. No but it's you look the way alela ndila mo na imoto mulela ndeta mm. So you are eating from one source. It don't don't kanyo dia kwa Thomas, it don't don't kanyo lienu, ne don't don't kanyo kwa Crowd. Ta mpuseni muli ba bomeni. So there is one source ukula from my information ya kumyebe ya kuchita. Looking at me when God connecting the dots. So what I'm saying. Number no, umfwe. Um, um, just um, continue um, but for one to ifwe. Umfwe. Umfwe. Pando point pano. You are saying could you have left me information? Me have got no yes. where I ah, in them yes. No, put him wakan, put him wakan. But you land at Shinka. Yo, we rach the but look. Eh, put him wakan, but keep it down mutima when because look at look at Ufani, Ufani, before you cut. No, listen. I know you are fond of you are fond of cutting. Ah. If we challenge you, Mulesta Mulesta cut. Ah. Because one end, look you at are Thomas. Coming, you are Thomas coming. yo, no, no, Nindeka, Ukuyevelela. No, okay. listen. Have you apologized to HH from Alelanda? Listen, my brother. Why well, have you apologized to him? No, my brother. In this, in this, my, my okay, brother. Okay, this year, this, my in, brother. in two months. In my, two months, hey, hold on, hold on, hold on. Hey, hey, hold, hold hey, on, listen, listen. I know it's your program. I, I, I don't okay. want to cut you, so okay. listen. Stop okay. and listen Another first. Another question. Uh, uh, Another stop. question. Stop. Uh, Another question. Stop. Another question. I don't want to uh, cut uh, you. Another so, question. Okay, no. let's change the subject. Uh, uh, I mean, we should be able to convince. Come on. Eh? We should be able to convince. I mean, look, the issue is that when you want to uh, when you want to, uh, to 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 make a point, I mean, be considerate Hello. of the other person. Just hold on a bit to my brother. Be considerate of the other person. You cannot be accusing me things. I'm sitting here, and I should allow you to just continue. I mean, you are accusing me that somebody is giving me information when I I am looking for that person to give me information. I am saying it here. I'm looking because. You, here you are already telling me that no, somebody is telling me what to say. No, I am looking for that person and hopefully that person can even pay me. I am saying it objectively, eh, truthfully. So you cannot be, hey, now we show come my information. Ah, eh? Let us not be, uh, uh, you know, uh, implicating or accusing others. Panopene pa program, yandu, ule mbepe chef ya ufi. Now we show you waku UK. Please, my brother, go ahead. Hello? Hello? Yes, yes, please. Yes, uh, machuma banjo atali. Bwino, bwino, machuma. Uh, I, and in a banda, mulusaka. Yes, we are Um, nezna, nezna in your preamble, you said that, uh, the people should not blame government or they should not put a burden on government on the death. I think ni hili pa social media of a young child uh -uh, uh -uh. who was iyo, maybe shoot. Iyo, iyo nkani? I don't want, I think we have deliberated on it to Ifaka aside. All right. Uh, because the more we are talking okay, about me... it, we are politicizing it. I don't want to politicize it. Na papat. Okay, okay, okay. Thank you. Let me take, take up something else. Please. Uh, Kampana, the previous caller, mm. uh, talking about what government is doing and is not sensitizing to people. Hmm. And uh, it is true that government is not sensitizing to people. And the, the reason why people are more criticizing, it is because people, they have been uh, kept in darkness. Hmm. And the still much condition, we want supplies. Yeah? We want to know what is taking place so hmm. that 
we stop criticizing it. So uh, it, it could be something better if someone comes out to shed light to us to say, no, we are putting a road in Kanyama. Mm. We are doing this and this, mm. rather than there is quietness. Quietness mm. won't help us with this economy and so forth and so on. Mm. So this is my issue, Mr. Dayali. Thank you for your platform. Thank you, my brother. Thank you. Mm. Hello? Hello? Eh, what are you doing, Bombashan? Eh, I'm going to go home. Eh, I'm going. Ah, I'm going to You know, in this economy, uh, you will find it difficult to uh, interact around because people nowadays, if you have to go home, you know, government is failing, government is failing. Yeah, yeah. We know. Uh, it's not everything that they have failed, but uh, failure, uh, in a, the only failure that I've seen in the government of the day is failing to, uh, to come out and explain to the people that uh, this is what you are doing. Mm. And even you, uh, we are finding it very difficult to explain because the people, the way they are coming on you, they think you are justifying the, the failures of the the people inside the, the system. Mm. Okay? Mm. Uh, hello, yep, took a phone. Hello, 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 hello. Yes, good evening. A quick one, Mr. Tayani. Yes, I heard you tell the other man that called that uh, UPN has policies that have. Uh, that are targeted at uh, alleviating the poverty challenges that uh, are affecting the people, especially with uh, uh, that have to do with food. Mm -hmm. Now, I want to know, give me six policies that you know that are directly uh, targeting the issue of uh, food security in the country and that are helping cushion the economy. Please, just five policies that you know that UPND has implemented, implemented. And please, don't think to ask the issue of CDF. <laughs> because no, CDF no. does not cutter for anyone. Okay, listen, because my brother. That, no, okay. before I, you... I speak like this because, yes, yeah, I'm before, waiting. Before, you, before you, you even go. I'm a policy analyst by profession. Uh, well, okay, yeah. that's good. That's good to hear. But now, listen, my brother. Uh, for me, this is this is what I, I'm, I'm singing about. I am actually saying, government. Uh, I wish government would do more to, you know, sensitize people, and that sensitization, including myself. Now, the second thing is that. Uh, you know, I'm not in government. I'm not in government. I'm not part of the UPND government. So some of these things, Moana, I cannot start to be laboring here to say government is doing this, Mr. is doing this, Dayali, is doing this. The answer is that there are no policies. That's why even you, you don't know. Uh -uh. Let's not beat about the bush. Wait, let me answer you. You have, you have failed to answer. Let me tell you, <laughs> UPND <laughs> has failed... This is just the truth. I've caught you unaware. But this is the truth. You see, you are a very smart man. This I know. Politically, you are a very smart man. You understand? It's, you cannot advertise what you do not have. They don't have that. It's not there. You understand what I'm talking about? Look, I'll give you an example, right? Let's talk about the... Let's talk about CDF. Let's talk about the issue of, of, of the vehicles that, that they bought. Right now... Millimil prices are very high. Uh, no problem. Okay? Nah. And and it nah. seems like it seems like buying those vehicles at the cost of one million kwacha is a good is a good thing. But when you go to actual constituencies mm. and you ask them what do you want right now, mm. it they will tell you it's better you buy as a guy. paten kwacha. maybe bucket. Elo so that we don't have to buy millimeter or 300 kwacha. 
You get what I'm saying? Yes, yes. Those are policies that directly they are able to help somebody, even the lowest. Mm. UPND has no policies. Otherwise, they would have been singing about them day and night. As politicians, you have the opportunity. You have the voices. You have the influence. We are killing our nation. Let's not do to UPND what we did to PF. Please. Tell these people, let us suggest these policies to them. Things are bad in Zambia. Let's not pretend. And they are getting worse. They were waiting for the for, for the for the IMF bailout. Now it's not it, it's, it's not happening. It's not happening. Today they reversed the issue of uh, of, uh, of, uh, of the 4,000 recruitment of teachers. Something that they announced in the budget. The president went in parliament. The finance minister went in parliament. They declared these things before the nation. The vice president mentioned to stay before December. We are eight days or nine days to December. And then today they reverse it. They say, no, we, and do you know the excuse that they gave? They said, we want to promote those that are already in employment. What lame excuse is that? With which money if you could not employ 4,000 people? <laughs> the man that told you to say about subsidies, that's the easy, you see, the lowest man on the ground is not going to understand the factors that are causing the, the kwacha to lose value or commodity prices to go. What they want is to put food in their mouth. That's all. Even the vehicles that they buy. Tell the other four, if you will. Yes. No. So please, you, they, you are. Yes, my brother. So there are no policies. Just tell people the truth. There are no policies. But as as a as a, as a, as a scientist, because you are a scientist, right? you say you are a po policy analyst. Yes. Uh, do you think he, it would be good to speak in absolute terms? Are you? Are we? Can we really speak in absolute terms? I think it is important because at the moment, when you look at UPND, they are struggling. That's why they cannot give us definite answers or solutions. So, 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 so when you do that, speak in absolute uh, uh, terms. yes, I'm a, yes, because you, you're not hoodwinking people. People need to brace themselves for the, for the West. Things are going to get worse, sir. Mm. So no. it's better you prepare the minds of the people. You, you know, I, I like what you say to say, when you look at the, the last crop of leaders that we had, mm. HH was the best of them all. We, we cannot deny that. Mm. We cannot deny that. Even if today elections were to be held, we cannot trust any, any other person in the opposition. Mm. That is just a fact. Mm. But the government needs to come out and start telling people the truth. That we have nothing. And they help people. Not, not we have nothing. That's why consultations are very important, Mr. Tayali. It's a democracy. Consult people. Yeah. Sometimes go back to those that have been in government. Yeah. No, thank you, my brother. It you will have, help you. No, thank you, my brother. You have you have made uh, good points. I must say, um, thank you. Mm. Hello. Hello. Yes, yes. London, <laughs> Ah, uh, in our daddy, therefore, could under go for fin to Fimo mm. as a UPND supporter. Mm. As a UPND supporter, Ningo for Valanda Vinch. Mm. But in an Oconga, who would take over UPND. Mm. They can go for an fin to Fimo if you if you today, Mona Fever, my UPND, because the Avash they support UPND, they can't see them. But I number one, ni if you have a social cash transfer, you show Muntunga send a 400. Mm. Then Ashto Bunga. Mm. Bushie, yo take which one you need. I send a 400, then Ashto Bunga. You should not be more free. You for number one. Number two, what do you have to do? Okay, to cash the figure in each province. Mukabe chigayo. Then if you figure younger fiala bomba, pika chita kushoni. 
Fika chita ko reduce. You also have more problems over there. And then number two, there is a pipeline you have to I think I'm going to go fine. Yeah. Uh -huh. There is a pipeline. That's why I'm going to go These things, we have to go fill on the roller. Go fuel. Fuel in that every month, whatever. But there is a pipeline you have to go. Then kwa sa is a lobito. Go Angola. Uh, if you feel safe, if you are a female, you should have a land, a land, no, if you want to have a no, there is no beetle, there is this pipeline, there is a female, a TZ, if you want to have a female, if you want to have a female, if you want to have a female, if you if we, if we are the PND, to live in Monocovati, Tabare Sarano, Sarota, to you are UPND, you are shan, as long as you form a cooperative. Not even my cooperative, my individuals, but they send them alone, but they send them a CDF grants, fiance, fiu, shit, but they feel monavan too. If we offer to live in Monava UPND, if if you feel that you show Nini, then it is a good fit riser, not to show poverty next season 20, uh, 2023 to 20, uh, 2024 uh, farming season. Not to move poverty, fit riser, and I were reduced. Eh, if not 600, a yeah, chan D compound, we shall go in next year. We shall wunga, wuka papa pay in the same, wuka doula, fit riser, munesh to 600. Maybe a doula coffee panon, ni. Urea, yeah, white, because maybe Baka, Baka Shta Kufialo. Ushe, fertilizer, 600, next season. Ushe, wunga, wuka verira, fe, fifi, neta waka chipe. Ushe, fe, nishta pali ofo vare, chita vay, UPND. Nifo, fe, tule, fi, mona, fe, ma, supporta, zi, wambita, vare, fi, mona. Opo, na, pere, la, waka, ram. Na, totela, I like this platform, because, you know, it's really a debate. It's really a debate, and I'm liking... You know how people are, are coming out. Uh, it's very nice. Uh, I'm also learning. Hello. Hello. Yes, please. Uh, what are you? Mm. Uh, um, I called the area Chiptuka. Okay. Uh, yes. Uh, so what I was uh, simply saying, uh, uh, at this particular time, you you find it very difficult to convince uh, ordinary citizens to say, no, these are the economic policies that uh, the UPN government have done. You know, it's their duty to explain to the people. You know, you'll be just suffering for nothing. Because, you know, what I've seen, the only problem is they're not explaining. Yeah. You know, information, if they are explained in a way that even an ordinary citizen in Kanyama compound would understand to say, okay, mm. this is what the government is doing about to do, or this is what they have started doing, and maybe in the future, yes. something will come out. Mm -hmm. in, in this case, whereby uh, the government is just quiet, they can't even talk about uh, economic policies that they have, you know, they can't even explain. I, I, I don't remember listening to any radio uh, program whereby any government official explaining how economic policies, what they are doing, what they have done, they just talk about CDF. But really, CDF has no impact on the ground. And that is there for everyone of us to see. Now, you are uh, facing us different callers mm. trying to convince them to say, <laughs> no, this is what they are doing. They have put up this economic policies and they will help. They are not doing so. And you are doing just to them, yes, and uh, that can be uh, commended. But... It's them who are failing, and failure, the way failure is, even on those uh, things that we don't touch, communication, you know? You know, for me, that is the only failure that I've seen at the moment. About economical issues, yes, I've read somewhere where they have written about what they want to do, but ask an ordinary Zambian in Kanyama compound to say, what is the UPND doing? They will just say nothing, because the prices of minimum, the prices of commodity prices, have gone up and it's very difficult you even you will find it very thank challenging you, my and difficult thank you. to convince thank you my brother thank you hello 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 yes please good evening mr payali good evening, good evening. Uh, it, it, it soothes me to hear a, a, a female voice please go ahead <laughs> <laughs> 
Okay. I just uh, wanted to talk about the, the two callers who first called from the UK. I'm currently in the UK myself. Mm. Um, I don't know what really they are talking about where uh, cost of living is concerned. I've mm. been living in the UK for the past 20 years and mm. I've seen the past two years, mm. I've seen the waste of the UK. Mm. I don't know where they, w w what part of the UK they are living to say, oh, they are doing this. Because just about two years ago, I could fill up my, my tank in my car, mm. a small a small car, mm. just using maybe 30 pounds. Mm. But you, you ask me now, mm. it has to be 70 to 80 pounds. You see? And just the, the poverty level mm. right now, it's in the Western world, the first mm. world country. Mm. It's... 10.3 10, 10, 10. million people are living below poverty line. 10? So I don't what? know what the... Give me that again. 10.3 10. 10. 10. 10. 10. 10. million. 10.3 yes. million people? Yes. In the UK? So, yes. Mm -hmm. So people are going to food banks. These uh, charities that uh, form... They get like things from uh, supermarkets, things that are... Uh, almost about to expire mm. and then people will be queuing to go to the food banks just to make ends meet mm. Mm. compared to the time i was coming here this mm. was heaven mm. you could do whatever you wanted to do mm. but I, I i don't understand why people can't see that this problem isn't just in zambia mm. it isn't just in zambia it's everywhere it's all over the world mm. because of the calamities that are going on Mm. wars and other things we mm. just went through covid mm. that had an impact on economy mm. and then uh, not to mention the wars that are happening in obviously ukraine and in the, in the middle east mm. people should try to understand and like he, I've, I've been listening um, to you i watch your programs more literally like every evening mm. if i'm not doing anything mm. The problem we have, I know in a way you, you've said, maybe the government should try by all means, maybe go, go to the exterior, the grassroots level, explain to people what is happening. People mm. should be there to, to sensitize them. Mm. They are trying their level best, like somebody has said, uh, social cash transfer. I know my, my mother in the village gets that amount, that, that helps. Mm. And people should learn, probably by all means, not to depend on the government for everything. Maybe try by all means. The government gives you 400 kwacha. Mm. What am I going to do with 400 kwacha? I'll mm. buy some mess, maybe take it to the to 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 the grinding mill and, and make. Then what else? Mm. Not just they are waiting for everything to come from the government. Then we are not going to go anywhere. So th this is just what I, I, I was uh, I wanted to say, but and and for for from what I've heard, mm. amongst the people who, who are there, uh, 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 like obviously who are saying uh, UPND has failed, they they they, they are trying to uh, uh, the political strategy to 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 make sure they get into there. But what yes. are they? But what are they to proposing? To Zambia? Yes. Mm -hmm. They, they, they are not telling us anything. Mm. So what are we going to bank on to say, oh, if this 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 party or if this leader comes in or they give us this, mm. they will change what he, what maybe UPND is doing. We are not hearing that. Mm. So really, we should think twice as Zambians and try to cushion the, 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 the government that is there. Give them something. At least if, if you can help, try to help. Because it's our country by, by the end of the day. Not just criticizing, oh, they failed, they failed. It's two, only two years. And the, the whole world is crying because of uh, the, the, the economic hardship. So that's all I wanted to say, Mr. Tairi. Thank you for giving me this opportunity. Thank you. Thank you very much. I really appreciate you. I've made very good points. Thank you. Mm -hmm. Hello? Good evening, Mr. Tairi. Good evening. Okay, um, I'm calling you from Eastern Province. Please go ahead. Thank you. Um, 
anyway bina ngo vitu vovu ta kuno kuchita explain ku mtu who is convinced that government is doing nothing to convince them mm. um the this this guy who called you at the, at the police at the police analyst hey, hey, hey. and he says the government has got no policy to reduce the cost of living in mm. now now government you you, you know there is fee for the vulnerable mm. now government has introduced another police on the run for civil servants soldiers mm-hmm. police officers to go into farming you get you can get up to 10000 of farming inputs and fertilizer is that not reducing the cost of living mm. is that not reducing to say if because if people are going to produce more it means that we are going to we are going to have more maize and then the cost of living is going to reduce because the people maybe will get down that's number one. Number two, the other, the other guy from UK calls and says, no, social caste transfer is doing nothing. Is it not the same social caste transfer that PF was using to steal up to them and many Kabanchi was arrested because of the same social caste transfer? Was it not a four, a, 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 four, a four billion we had in PF? Social caste transfer has three phases. It has for the chronical, the, the chronical ill, it has people that are disabled, it has people that are child headed homes so these amounts are different others are getting 800 after two months others are getting 600 after two months others are getting 400 after two months the people that are speaking don't understand what is happening ndala we had the vulnerable children not getting into school people, people are trivializing issues of free, free education we had the children in the streets ndala even here in the rural areas we had cases of children getting into marriage because they never had the money to get into school to tell they just walk into school then they will find a teacher and the government is providing everything are those issues that we can be trivializing sure it's it's very sad that uh, people begin to trivialize serious issues i think uh, like the other caller said from uh, is it barston i think government needs to speak more the people that are in charge of speaking let them speak more you cannot do the speaking because you you, you are not getting any salary so you are just doing the whole that way yeah, exactly so the, the, hey, those I, that are paid hey, those hey, that are paid hey. let them do their job <laughs> because someone cannot be speaking on your behalf when another person is getting money somewhere hey. it's, 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 it's not fair <laughs> so let people that are no it doesn't let people that are paid to do their job if if they don't want to they can be fired and others are appointed it's as simple as that mm-hmm. i wish i was the president <laughs> thank you thank very you. much thank you <laughs> hello hello yes yes eh hey, what are you yes yes sir masweza bwanji bwino bwino bwanji bwino bwino ndisho matini Yes, sir, Martin. Yeah, ah. Uh, Hello? Hello, uh, Martin. Yes, sir, Martin. Yes. Sorry, enzi ya Jubik. Mm. Eh, eh, ya program ya bwino maningi ndala. Pia mikirani, hivi ni zo, vindu siviri buwena ndara, kamba checho chilungamo. Mm. Especially kuma kombo wa ni wanduwa votika. Mm. Mpasawa kutuwa na mungu mwa kwa ndirengi. Uwe, ni kutia kwa na tutu vinku walao. Eee, mkombo wa ni umu wa ndara, waku diacha bensi magamozi these days. Mm. Tishita witinesi kutara mkombo wa ni umu. Mm. Vandu vavutika. Government sembe yarangana pali vandu vamene vavutika, vamene vari bevochita. Vamene vari makombo ni umu, muli ma problems ya kulu. Ya kuti mwavene mukambira so ngati vakumverane mwa tayari mushita sacrifice apa vanga kugwireni na pamukosa. So, afune kira government ke konzero iranganire ko pali vandu vavutika makamaka umu ma communities, makombo ni compound. Mm. Mwamene muliri mumba mandevu mu mate eh, George compound mm. tikarangana kwa na kwa kanya makuja 
vantu wafutika wakutia kamozi these days vantu wa president hh pamene mezo buena mupao wa wana promisa vantu ati muzamba kutia beef muzamba kutia ka beef o chipa mm. to beef mwondo mwe wana nga these days o good hundred kwacha hundred kwacha ya mene nga tichabe uh, waichi nja hundred kwacha nishikuwa sira ya sira ndrama ilipi value hundred kwacha mm. then uh, Kuli wa uma nezo wa tuma wako wako England, ine na choka ku Cape Town ya hapa soko. Mm. Chika shita kompea, wa ntuwa wali ku Cape Town kuja, kuli ndrama kuja, wa ntuwa fora ndrama masara dizi ya buwilu. But fewe weli pazingati kuja. Fewe weli eh, about 21,000 kwa, eh, 20, eh, 21, 22, 23 rands South Africa, fewe wapu. Muno mm. tukula 30 kwa cha, but... Kuringana na ndrama za mene tipeza mwono, nizi ngono, weva javangana na ndrama za mbili. So kukamba ni grobo, yes, ni grobo. But why is wanga fake kusubsidies? Kuti wantu, at least vindo vingareko reduced. Ku South Africa kuja, ene natoka Cape Town. Ku South Africa, so, pamene ni kamba pano. Fiwe wosinga ringane na mwono mzambi. It is very high. It is very high. It's about 20... Kuku mono mono muzami ya mono ni, 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 ni almost 30 kwacha. Ku South Africa it's 23 kwacha. Difference ni kuru maningi. It's about 7, seven kwacha difference. Ku South Africa na kuma. So ya mene wakamba ni grobo. Government isi ganzira jabe wanduwa vutika. Wanduwa vutika mwa community mwatu. Maka maka ifa ntinga na mwa community. Tuwa na ma problems ya mene ya limu. If ni kila government ike kwenze ilu itandizire makamaka wanduo vutika. Not yavari pa mwamba kutara. Because it's like, this government is just looking for waja. Mwena ni makombo ni wanuwa gulisa tomato, wanuwa gulisa kapenta, wanuwa gulisa small small businesses. Government, siri chita na care kwa liwe. So ndiye complaint ni yo. Not it is inama na box up. Wandu wamene wa vutika, even if tinga chita protect government, tinga ika mbile vabu ino kutunowa. There is nothing. Iyo, iyo, amene waka ambayo ma, ma grandi, ayo, mashani, amene wapa asa ma CDF, sivi chitika na kuchitika, wapa asa ma chewe kaweka, umve na chea tiu kwa wanapa na asa, wana wana chita so. Ife tinae saa kwa voe nse, wotaenda kwa mabanki, tachai, so we spend a lot of money, ya niti na spendinga kutiti, tingale na account, na manje wantu watu wakapote nga ma CDF. So fi avu fi, tafi wombeka no kubombeka ifi. So I think Vatari are doing a good job, but somehow Vatari eh, That's what I can say. Thank you so much. Thank you, my brother. Thank you. Hello. Yeah, President Tari. Yes, yes, sir. Hello. Hello. Yes, I can get you. Mm. Get you. Please go ahead. Yeah. Yeah, thank you so much. Uh, I like the way you analyze issues. But there's only one on the issue of EP, which is your party, and the way you want to work with other parties. That's why, I'm not, that's why I want you to get it clear, or you clear me, whichever. Sir, so, I think if you see it in a way like working with the current government, I don't think it's possible. The reason is simple. We've seen people defecting. They are not welcome. We've seen this part is what it is. Yeah, you are talking of strategy. I was following closely. It's a good strategy. They can drop your uh, court issues. Yeah, 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 yeah. But working with them, ah, they can't accept you. They are afraid of themselves. They can't. Why? They can't. <laughs> Mr. Tari, just mm. one more. Just look at it. Mm. There are people who have been fighting with them. Mm. Those who can't even really rebuke them. They mm. always place them. But yet they are still in a corner, suffering. Mm. Now, the way honest you are, and you even know how much more politicians doesn't like honest people, mm. like you, mm. what is the chance that you can be considered mm. to work with them? I don't think it's possible. <laughs> if there's another way, Consider alternatives, just like you advise BF to find alternative of making another party. Mm. 
do so as well. These people, yes, maybe cases they can drop for you, but working with them, how it is, they are so insecure, and the way they hit, they hit the bush, you, you don't do that. Mm. So two cannot move together unless they agree. Mm. You can, they will do something, you come and expose them. <laughs> they will let you down. <laughs> because they are used to these things of not being straightforward. So I really appreciate your strategy in conclusion, but with them working with you, I mm. know uh, it's impossible. <laughs> it is. Yeah. No, thank you, my brother. Thank you. You're welcome. Mm. Yeah. Anyway, I think um, I'll leave it here for tonight. I'll leave it here for tonight. Uh, we have had um, an interesting, an interesting uh, debate. I, I, um, I'm always, um, I think these days really, I'm grateful for the kind of uh, calls that uh, uh, I'm getting. You know, people are being reasonable. Um, people are being respectful, except that one who was lying against me on my platform to say there is somewhere where you are getting information, please. I mean, don't speak, don't accuse a person. I mean, before, in his face, eh, when you cannot substantiate it. I mean, I wish eh, I was getting that information somewhere. I'm crying here, and you have even heard this one is saying, you, they can't work with you. You know, I don't know. So, I mean, I don't think it's fair. Um, let's be sincere. Let's not um, um, impute, uh, you know, suspicions where they are not supposed to be. Otherwise, I'm grateful. Uh, thank you very much. Um, tomorrow is uh, Thursday. Uh, I will come back again and um, discuss other issues. I hope um, I'll prepare something that I can be able to talk about. Today, I couldn't prepare. So that's why I just opened it up and just discussed whatever came my way. But maybe tomorrow, I can be able to, to engage. Yeah, each other not chup, oh, that's for sure. Each other not chup and the... You know, you ish. I'm a pressure quiet. I'm a pressure. I already call bad. But anyway, um, God will be there for us. Maybe let me take this call because this is this is the number that I've never seen. Hello. Oh, hello, Prophet Harry. This is. Uh, I'm taking this this call as the last one because it looks strange. Oh. Which country is this? No. <laughs> oh, yeah, yeah, 60. Okay, yes, 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 yes. You know, you are the only uh, one. Yeah, no, 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 I remember. Yes. Hmm. Hey. 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 But the folks that contribute to Kovati, uh, in Chito, minimum level, Madao Kosavata, you seem to go in a just way, maybe, Panan. Yeah, unfortunately, our Caledonia, Yap took a line, and I think we'll just leave it there. We'll come and talk tomorrow. Thank you very much. May God bless you. May God bless Zambia. Good night.